As a husband, you must never allow your family members to frustrate your wife. My name is Olushe Gumukuyu. It is your responsibility as a husband and head of your marriage to ensure that your family members do not insult, dishonor, harass, accuse, and generally frustrate your wife. Your wife is bone of your bone and flesh of your flesh, particularly if you profess to be a child of God. It is not proper, it is not right for you to sit down as a man and allow members of your family to insult your wife or to frustrate her. It is your responsibility to defend that woman, to stand by her. The two of you are already one. The Bible says, for this reason shall a man leave his father and mother and cleave to his wife. The person that God expects you to cleave to, to have allegiance to, is your wife. And this is not in any way to say that your wife is perfect. This is just biblical principle. This is how marriage works. Let it be very clear to everyone in your family that that woman is the bone of your bone, flesh of your flesh, and that you will stand by her any day at any time. If your family members are dishonoring your wife, if they are insulting her or frustrating her, the truth is it is because you have allowed it. If you stand by your wife and keep your home intact and every matter between you, you both retain it within yourself, then you will see that nobody will insult your wife. Even if your wife had done something, you must protect her outside. You must not put her to shame. And then when you are together, you can then deal with that issue. You can then talk together and iron your differences. But you must always present a united front to the family. Once family suspect that you are divided, they will take advantage of it. A house divided against itself cannot stand. But I tell you the truth, two are better than one. He says a cord of three strand is not easily broken. So when you unite with your wife, when you are truly one with your wife, the Bible says for this reason, a man shall leave his father and his mother and shall cleave to his wife and the two shall become one. So it is a biblical principle for marriage. It is the word of God that you must become one. You must protect your wife. The Bible says that husband love your wife as Christ loved the church and gave himself. There's nothing wrong for you to give yourself on behalf of your wife. This is what the Lord expects of you as a Christian husband. This is the counsel of the Lord. I am Olusha Gumokuolu. God bless you.